Hello everyone, welcome back to more Let's Play Legaia 2 Dual Saga. In the last episode, we explored most of Demiurge Tower. In fact, I think we only have the final boss remaining in the tower. Uh, we fought all three wicked crystals. <laughs> I don't know why they're called wicked crystals, but they are. It's, uh, it's very goofy. There are a couple of items that we missed, but... Uh, honestly, we only missed three, and I'm... Sure, they're right before the boss, so we'll be able to get them before, uh, before too long. Anyway, in today's episode, it's Karabia time. We're gonna do some missions, some guild missions, which is beautiful. We love getting missions. Uh, ask about available quests. Let's do the Winged Mountain Beasts. 160k. The reward money is high because they're really dangerous. Let's accept. They're really ferocious, but you still wouldn't accept the challenge? You must be a thrill seeker. Maybe it's the money. I wouldn't if I were you. Zahutule. Zahatules aren't like ordinary monsters, you know. Really? Thanks for the warning. I already accepted it, so I guess I'll go through with it. Huh. Responsible type, huh? It'll be too late to change your mind when you're dead. Maybe I'll head over there and rescue you later. Don't kick the bucket before I get there. Oh, goodness. Time to go to... Frickin... Mount Gable, because I forgot the name of the mountain. <laughs> Let's hop on over there. And... Actually, I just realized I don't think I healed. So let's do that really quick. There we go. Fully healed. All right. So, there are mountains here. Mountains here. There are beasts here. Somewhere. Uh, we will. I'm actually going to keep this little fight in because honestly, there's just no point in cutting it. Oh, Maya's going to use an attack. That's so cool. I don't think you're going to do a lot of damage, girly. I won't lie to you. Yeah, that is one thing, is Maya is, like, pretty weak with most of her moves. Good lord, though. Did she do enough there? Be shocked if this did more than zero. Okay. Well. Keller me surprised. Oh, good lord. Sorry, I was reading one of my notes for... <laughs> I was reading one of my notes for this mission. And it just straight up says... Uh, that I'll read it once we get there. Oh no, the effect of the cooking has worn off. Whatever shall we do? I'm going to use a Heaven's Gate. Because I don't need to fight like level 10 enemies here. Anyway, I'll, I'll show you my notes right here. Steel? Ha. Huh. Didn't want anyone to see me like this. I wanted to kill them all before you showed up, but I don't think I'll be doing much more fighting now. Hang in there. Let me get you some medicine. Huh. Forget it. That's not going to help at all. Just keep going. There's still one more out there. Ran off towards the summit. Managed to wound it pretty badly, so even you should be able to beat it. Go get it. In my notes, it says, Steel lays there being a punk-ass bitch. <laughs> so, that's... <laughs> that's my my notes for that guy. <laughs> Sometimes I, like, look at my notes, and I'm just like, what was I cooking that day? What's going on here? It's just very goofy. Anyway, I think that may have used up our Heaven's Gate, which is really unfortunate. Oh, it didn't. Cool. We are just climbing all the way to the top of the mountain, though, so it shouldn't take us too, too terribly long. And once we kill the enemy, I think we're just gonna cut to the guild like we normally do. Because we still have quite a few missions to do. And today's episode is all about finishing up these missions, so... Oh. Uh... Yeah. I can always buy some more Heaven's Gates. So we'll just use them all up. Might as well. 
No point in not just buying 99 of them, though. Whenever I go back to the... The secret... Okay, I believe... The, uh, the enemy is up here. Could be wrong? Is he not up here? Am I dumb? Yes, he is. Okay. I was like, I could have sworn this enemy was up here, but he is. Or it is, rather. So, this is a Zaho tool. This thing has 100,000 HP. We're gonna... Actually, you know what? We'll do Airborne Fury. No. Uh, down, right, up. Down, left, up, right, down, left. And then you do your normal thing. And then I'm gonna have you... That's right. We're mixing it up. Maya's gonna use her opener. Which is called Pyro Fury. So right, left, left, up, down, right. And let's see how it goes. We'll see if we even survive this Inferno move. Which we should. Yeah, it did basically nothing. But yeah, Maya is very tanky, honestly. Oh, oh, okay. How's that? Okay, did quite a bit of HP, and honestly, Ain's probably going to finish it off. Oh yeah, for sure. After one hit, it did 13,000. Oh, well, maybe not, actually. So I would need him to do 30k. Oh, never mind. He did finish it off. Why even try? That's right, buddy. Why even try? Art acquired Pyro Fury. There we go. That's one less monster. And that is the whole mission. So I'll see you back at the guild where we collect our our gear or our money rather. So actually there's actually but actually 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 good lord it's my favorite word I guess. Uh, there's one thing we need to do before this mission's up. I just realized. Uh, I had it down in my notes a little bit further than I thought. I don't know why. But we actually will be... I need to stop saying that word. I need to stop using that filler word. There is an interaction we can do with Steel that will actually impact... That will impact <laughs> a future mission. Not by like a ton, but it will have an impact for sure. So Let's go talk to Steel real quick. Or style, I would I would assume it's steel. But let's go chit chat with him. It's always fun coming back to Kazan's house because there's just nothing there. Okay, back to steel we go. Honestly, I I kind of wish they would fill out more of Kazan's backstory because Nazak is such a cool thing. Hello, steel. Looks like you managed to kill it. I was going to try and help, but... Steel, thanks. Don't say another word. I don't want any new friends. I only offered to help because the job required it. So, what do you want to do about the reward money? I killed one of them and you killed the other. The fair thing to do would be split it. I figured you'd say that. Okay, we'll split it. I'll go to the guild and pick it up. Time to turn in the award! 130 grand? What? I was supposed to get 80. Central Continental Unit won rewards you in addition to the 80,000. They know how dangerous those monsters were. Certainly a true hunter now. Do you have any kind of special nickname you go by? Well, let's get some more quests done. As you can see, that has unlocked the final two, I think. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. We're actually missing three. There are three we're missing, but it's okay. We're gonna keep on going. It's a quest from a woman named Suda and Yuna. Go talk to her there and go there and talk to her directly for the details. War money is 140k. Accept the quest. Just remember that a vicious monster is spreading the germs that cause this disease. Be very careful. 
Well, let's go to Yuna. Or Yuno. That's what it's called. Because, you know, it's Yuno. Alright, let's go to the windmill. Or not the windmill, but the uh, watermill house. There's Suda. He must be the one who accepted the quest. I knew it. Gares has returned, just like before. Gares? A demon from hell, Gares. A curse upon our world. His body's filled with venom, so as long as he lives, the plague of the Pulu fever will spread. But that is just the beginning. For far more horrifying things lie ahead. We must rid ourselves of him before it's too late. We must be extra careful. His venom triggers triggers illness. Triggers? <laughs> what is what is that word? And the illness can bring death. Gares must be somewhere in the forest maze. I'm counting on you. Okay. Well, let's go. Except we're not going to go into the north side. We're going to go to the south side. Because it's actually way closer to get to. Also, I decided to buy some Heaven's Paths or Heaven's Gates. They aren't at the secret market like I thought they were. They are instead... They are instead in Tanza, which I forgot about. Alright, though. Let's just go on north. Because eventually we should encounter... These two! Vanta, me weak. No more walk. It's no time for making excuses. And it's your own fault for dropping the mizzle red sand that we bought from the peddler. You rush me. Ugh. Balzac need food badly. No more walk. Well, let's see if we can talk to them. No, stomach empty. Need dream burger. Need meat. I think I actually have one. Hmm, is this it? Oh, meat, meat, meat. Mmm, mmm, tastes good, meat good. Oh, stop hogging it. Give me some of that. I'm not really hungry. I was just joking. Well, we gave him some stuff. Anyway, we are actually going to be going, I believe, uh, north. Wait, for real? It says go north and then hit west at the fork. All right. I could have sworn we were going to a different location, but this works. Uh, then south of the next fork. Okay. It says we'll find the enemy here. I'm going to believe it. Oh, there it is. Hmm. Is this thing that the thing that's been plaguing you know for this this strange disease? Rawr. Sure is, man. And it's just a reskinned uh what nether. Puppy? I don't remember the name of it. <laughs> Honestly, might be able to just kill it with regular moves. A Gares has... I actually had it already pulled up. It has... 180,000 HP. So let's actually... Yeah, we'll open with a variable art. Why not? Uh, we'll do... Airborne Fury. And you will do... Armageddon Star. You will just do gospel. This thing is probably going to cause plague. If I had to guess. Oh, it doesn't. Interesting. No plague. It is fast, though. Alright, variable art time. Hundred and ten K. Well, we're only short 70. Uh... Sorry, I'm reading my notes. I say my notes, but honestly, some of them are not mine. I just copy and paste it from legendoflagaia.net. Which, once again, very good spot to start with uh, any Lagaya questions, uh, including the Legend of Lagaya game. If you wanted to play that game, you could look at a walkthrough that's on there. And it's actually pretty helpful, to be honest. 
Okay, I can't do this again, so we'll just Sleeping Dragon. And then you will just use uh, Power Blade, even though you can't afford it right now. Uh, Shock Force, Full Impact, and then we will Whirlwind Attack. Now you, just use whatever you have. God, I love, I love how little damage I receive for everything. Okay, we're 70k short. Let's see how much this does. Oh, that did a lot. Thankfully, Lang, can, Lang has infinite AP, so we have no concerns here. Okay, 39k is not bad. Another 41 will be good. Honestly, even though Ain's not going to be able to use his Hyper Arc, he might be able to kill. I'm very curious to see. Yeah, we need, uh, what is that, 35k or something? 32, 33? Oh my god. I love how powerful I am, though. Now, for reference, this enemy's level is 61. Okay, yeah, we definitely killed it. Uh, this enemy's level is 61, and you're meant to do this, like, pretty early on. Like, you can do this quest before you even go to Draconia, which would make it much harder. <laughs> Managed to beat him somehow. Okay. Once you kill him, I believe you return to the guild. So, I'll see you guys over at the guild. Once we hit the screen transition. Transition complete. And the monster is completed. 140k. Before I forget, the people of Yuno sent a thank you gift. It said it's rare treasure handed down to Yuno for antiquity. Got the maiden's robe. Now once again, you can do this pretty early on. Uh, as you will see, this maiden's robe sucks. <laughs> It's actually not terrible. Uh, I would argue better than the Dark Princess, but yeah, we have Alice's robe, which gives us HP recover, upper defense boost two, and lower defense boost two. And we already have uh, upper defense boost two and lower defense boost two. And so we're just we, we're just killing it on Maya. Maya is just the tankiest MFer we have right now. Uh, ask about the available quests. All right, let's find Mari. Ooh, I want to do all three of these, but let's start with Find Mari. This is a quest from Cami, the one that got lost recently. She says she got separated from her friend Mari during the recent trouble in the sewers. Your job is to find Mari. Let's accept. I'll accept the quest. Cami's staying at the three-star hotel in Derrickin. She's staying in one of the standard rooms. Talk to her directly to get the rest of the details. Okay. Okay, where is Cami? It said standard room, which I assume is upstairs. Yeah, looks like it's upstairs. Well, let's go upstairs, see what Cammy's doing. I would assume she's this first room. Uh, no, that is a like a love hotel suite thing. Uh, what about you? There you are. Hey, listen, Mari is lost. We went down below together, but then I lost her. Lost my dearest friend. I still pursue pursue beauty's way. Life is very hard. Saiku expresses my pres present feelings for my dear friend in terrible danger. I'll look for her. What does your friend look like? Mari is fair, very fair complexion, but she might have di gotten dirty in the sewer water. Please find her. Okay, so she says the sewers. Here you know, we gotta go back down there. Back down to the stinking sewers. It's really unfortunate, but it's okay. We'll survive. Alright, luckily we still have the Heaven's Gate. Okay, well, I just had to say something. <laughs> and of course, it runs out! So, we actually want to uh, head east. I believe down here. So we actually do want to be in this room. We want to go down here. And into this room. Or no, not this room. Sorry. We want to go down further. Oops. 
we want to go down the stairs down the sewers up the stairs we need to get across over here and go into this room where the cat is so push that oh wait I need to do that the other way <laughs> ah I see the cat okay so it's like a weird Like, I don't know how to describe it. Also, I went the wrong way. Uh, I don't know how to describe this. Just like a hunting mission? I don't know. You just gotta keep going around and around for this damn cat. Yeah, you're just stuck, buddy. Caught the cat. The name Mario is written on the collar. Alright, let's get back out of here. Let's give her back to Cammy. And hopefully Cammy can shut up. Let's climb the ladder. Thank you. I love the idea that when you stop in front of like a ladder, Kazan's just staring at it like, I don't know what to do. Until finally your your the player says, Go up the ladder, bro. Kicking, huh? That doesn't sound right. Oh, Mari, thank heavens you're still alive. Well, thank you. Well, I guess that takes care of the quest. It sure does, Lang. It sure does. I love the idea that Kazan and... Like, everyone's waiting on Kazan to go up the ladder. But he's like, I don't know what this does. I can't I can't figure it out, guys. And Lang's just back there like, Master, you, could, you can just climb it. And he goes, what, how do I do that? Until the player finally hits yes to climb the ladder. And he goes, oh, what the? I'm doing it, guys. I'm doing it. I'm climbing. I don't know. I love the idea of it being silly like that. Anyway, let's collect our reward. Must be a nice change of pace. Honestly, it kind of was. Ask about the available quests. I am going to... Fight the writhing monster in the dark. According to the confidential information from the castle staff, the Doppling Castle underground leads to some giant ruins. Your quest is to investigate the mysterious growling. The reward money is a hundred and sixty thousand dollars. Okay. Except, tell me you can get to the underground through the Doppling Castle annex. Good luck. Wait, wait a minute. Huh? That quest you just accepted, it looks pretty interesting. Huh? You, small guy, you take quest? Dangerous monsters there. You go, you no come back. Only really experienced hunters like us will be able to handle it, right, Balzac? Right. My golden muscles smash the unsmashable. <sighs> Are you even listening? Anyway. We're declaring war on you right here, right now. We're going to complete that quest before you, thank you very much. Right, PvP use muscles. Muscle always win. True. True, muscles always win. Yeah, let's not forget the time I gave you a dream burger because you were starving, bro. Anyway, let's go back to Dublin Castle. Or, well, I guess to Derek and Citadel and then to Dublin Castle. Let's go all the way. Actually, let's check in here really quick. Okay, no one's learning how to cook. That's fine. Sometimes you just gotta make sure. Okay. We're going all the way to the top. This goes all the way to the top. We're gonna have to take it down from the inside. Honestly, I was thinking about it. Maybe, maybe this series is gonna be a lot shorter than I thought. Alright, thank god we, uh, we got- Oh, what? It's literally every time. <laughs> every time I go, oh yeah, thank god we still have it, and then we lose it instantly. Uh, in reference to the Heaven's Gate. Good lord. Okay, let's just- Did I ever get those items? I did, okay. I wasn't sure. Had to double check. <laughs> yeah, honestly, this ep these, uh, this series might be pretty much over. I don't- foresee myself uh, 
Yes, climb down the ladder. I don't foresee myself needing to... Or having a way to fill out, like, two... Two whole episodes. Or two whole videos, rather, sorry. I don't know why I'm apologizing about that. I don't need to apologize to you. I don't need to apologize to anybody. Because all it has this figured out. I remember when I was younger and I tried to, like, get through all this. I was so over-leveled by the time I got to uh, Slogar the first time. That it just didn't even... I, I Like, nothing happened. Because there's that Slogar fight... Oh, hey! There's that Slogar fight in the... Uh, chapel whenever you find out about the uh, the Black Sun and the Eclipse. Whoa, dude! You gotta be kidding me! There's no way I can win against that, babe! What are you talking about? Pull yourself together! We can't turn back now! That's right. I shot out a lot of money to get the lowdown for you. Let's see what the guide... with. Let's see. With the guide feed... That'll be a million G total. Come on. Time for you to pay up. A million G? We won't make that kind of money even if we manage to take the monster down. Only can do smash time. Balzac run. Okay. It's now time to fight... Latogus. Which has 222,000 HP. Let's open up a solid strike. You, uh, just do your thing, and you, you already know what you're doing. Shockwave. Let's kill this thing. Yeah, that's Heaven's Fury, all right. Okay, we did about a third of its HP. Oh my god! That was actually really cool looking, I won't lie. This thing, yeah, this thing has a lot of HP and it will deal a good amount of damage if you're not careful. The, de uh, the guy that I'm using recommends you use the power necklace. But, I mean, look at that little amount of damage we're doing, or getting hit with. Oh, whoops. There we go. Attack. Yeah, just do your same attack, and then I'm going to have you gospel. Because this thing is just not... <laughs> it's not going to live for long. Because again, we are a little over leveled for all these guild missions at this point. Well, maybe over level is the wrong term, but. Definitely, uh. Definitely a little stronger than we need to be for most of this stuff. Um. Yeah, no, we're good, okay. Honestly, I think we only. Like, I think we have one other mission left. After this. Do, 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 do. Yeah, okay. We have one other mission left before we get our final, final mission. Holy shit. With Gospel, this man just got a 3k damage boost with his Hyper Art. What the hell? This is crazy. He's almost dead. Oh. Yeah, that's fine. This thing does not hit very hard. It's a very easy fight. Alright. You just use uh, Blind Fury and Ice Flow and Dark Disaster. Not that you'll need to go. Actually, you might need to attack. Uh. 
Okay, sorry, I'm I was looking at my notes again and uh we might not be ready for the final <sighs> final mission. I don't know. I think we'll be okay. Oh, yeah, we'll live. We'll be okay. We do get a lot of experience for this battle, though, so that's good. Ain has acquired max AP, thank god! That means we can just pump out variable arts if we want it. Lang! Did you kill that humongous monster? Yeah, I took him down. That's impossible, you must be lying. I'm sure it's just unconscious or something. I bet it's still alive. Whoa, danger, danger, Fanta, Balzac, run! Hey, wait up! You still owe me! <laughs> yep, and that's it. So I'll see you guys back at the guild for our reward! Reward money, please. According to the Central Continental Union's investigation, the monster you defeated was from another world. According to records, it's called Latogus, Beast from the Sealed World. Reward money is 160 Gs. 160,000 Gs, sorry. You must have reached expert level by now. Have you considered making working for the guild full time? The CCU sent you another thank you gift. They said it's a weapon excavated from the ancient ruins. A raging axe. And we all know what axes do. They go to Lang, or Aang, sorry. The raging axe. It's fire and more strength against giants, but I won't lie to you. It's not worth it. Because <laughs> this gives me strength boost and HP siphon, and it's just so much better. Just so much better. Anywho, we have... 100's Guild. There are two... Big missions left for us. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. 12 missions. There's 12 total missions that we've done so far. I... Wait a minute. I'm shocked. <laughs> Hold on. Uh, let me go through the list and make sure we did everything. Okay. Done. 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 Uh, done. Wait, let me, let me make a nose. A, a nose? A note. What am I not, what have I not done? This, this, and this. Huh. Well, anyway, let's accept this. We're going to be going to Gale Canyon. Man's already accepted this quest, too. The reward money will be given to whichever defeats the monsters first. Is that okay? Accept the quest. So you accepted that quest too, huh? Scary. Sorry to tell you this, but you'll just end up working for nothing, you know. Oh, you again. Don't try to steal our work. Muscles make the real man. Hmph. <laughs> we'll be waiting for you at the north entrance to Gale Canyon. Make sure you show up. Well. Honestly, we can do that in the next video. So thank you guys so much for watching today's episode of Let's Play the Guy 2 Duel Saga. And you thought I was being serious. No, I'm kidding. You see the length of the video. We're doing all the guild missions today. Come on now. Well, all the remaining ones. So, once you're ready, go to Gale Canyon and get ready. Blah, blah, blah. Glad to see you can make it, Lang. You're not afraid of a little competition, I hope. The team that kills the most monsters on the wanted list in the cannon gets the money. Well, time's a-wasting. Me kill more, me smash more, me do push-ups, make muscles. Man must be strong, must smash. Need muscles to smash. Lang, do push-ups with Balzac, make more muscles for smashing. Just ignore him, he'll go on like that for hours if you let him. Don't take this the wrong way, but that guild money's mine. See you at the guild. Okay. Just fight all the enemies. Now, Lava Beasts are actually a little bit harder than they seem. Uh, and that's actually what enemy you'll be fighting while you're here. 
And you know what? We'll show off one of the fights. I don't know why I decided to cut out the previous one, but here we go. So, really quick, I forgot that Ain is at max uh, AP always, so we might as well just level up Power Blade. And yeah, you do your thing. Oh, he's going to use a Terror Howl. I think that makes someone fear? Frozen with fear. So Lang's not going to be able to attack this turn, which is A-okay by me. Lang's pretty much maximum power. Anyway, these things have 40,000 HP. And although they are like guild monsters, uh, the, the previous guild monsters we have fought have been more like boss-like. And these are just... I mean, they're, they're essentially just the revived... Uh, Hellhounds, or whatever they were called, from uh, Hunter's Wood way back when. Anyway, I'm checking to see if Triple Power Blade does more damage than uh, Aang, just, or Aang just doing his regular thing. Which, it's funny, because it looks like it's doing more every time? How did it do more damage every time it was used? What the hell? That's cool! Well, it definitely did more damage overall, though, so... Works out. Let's just keep on going. Now, luckily, these uh, these enemies are out in the open, so you don't have to, like... You know, randomly encounter them. Yeah, just keep... Walking around the canyon, and you'll find them. So, one thing I may have forgotten to do... Is uh, equip this skill. Oh, yeah, give you MP Thief. That would be good. Equip this skill onto Ain. Because although Guard Break 2 is great, it's not that useful. Anyway, here we go. You can actually see one off in the distance just running around. Oh, there's one down there. Let's, uh, let's take it on. Since we know we can just grab this one. Just right here. Yeah, you can actually... S Hello? Let me down? <laughs> what the fuck? Alright. Let's fight this guy and then... Who? Well, from that, Ain actually leveled up. Hehe, <laughs> Nice. That's, that's actually the legit only reason I wanted to open up the menu, was to show that. Okay, we're on, I think we're almost there, to be honest. Like, we got a couple more. Do I need to heal? Eh, we'll heal just to be safe. But yeah, I don't think we have that many more Lava Beasts to do, or to kill. Now, since uh, Ain has max AP, I was actually able to get uh, his Power Blade, I think is what it's called. Yes, Power Blade to level up into Axe Crush. Which, we'll see if that does, you know, the damage we're looking for. But who knows? Okay, I think there's another one over here? Maybe not? No, there's not, okay. It's all the way up top. It goes straight to the top. I think I've already made that joke today. Oh, this one's already dead. Did I kill that one? I don't think I did. Uh, honestly, I'm at this point, I'm just looking. I don't know where they could be. I don't think there's any back here, though. No, it doesn't look like it. Well, huh. Where is the final beast? Cause that one's dead too. Ruh -ruh raggy. Are we out of beasts to kill? Unless there's one back there that I didn't see, which I don't think is the case. Let's go to the front. Let's go to the main area. Hello? There we go. I don't think this is actually timed. I think no matter what you do, you are going to be doing... Uh, more than the other two. I mean, we've already killed like seven. I think. 
Let's see, there's one. Oh, there's, see, there's one up there. And these, uh... Most people can't even reach up here. That means there's one left. Luckily, it's right there, though, so we don't have to go very far for it. But yeah, once... Once you've killed a bunch of them, there'll be one howl, and that will be the indicator that you're down to your final one. Oh, that was a cool little screen transition. I don't think I've seen that one. But anyway, let's fight this last one on camera, because why not? Also, you may be able to see uh, Ayn's cool move, permitting this guy doesn't cause fear onto Ayn. Please? Awesome. I'm fine with Lang have being frozen with fear, because... It doesn't really gain anything. Or it doesn't really give us the kill. Ain does give us the kill, so. Here's hoping. Here's hoping. Frost arise. Frost arise. Black Knight. Okay. God, look at that move. And it's just gonna do more damage. Bam. God, it's so cool. 10,000 experience for your troubles. That looks like the last monster. What if I killed more than Balzac and Fanta? And with that, you actually just... Head straight back, uh, straight back to the guild. So let's go do that. Because honestly, this is definitely quicker to just go this way. To the guild! It's brilliant. It's beautiful. Okay. I think we have one more quest to do. Ah, we received 180k. It's kind of nice to compete with someone, or someone else every now and then, don't you think? No. Over the Hunter's Guild, we provide quest referrals to you. Let's ask about the available quests. We've got two quests left, and we're going to do them. The Glow and the Thunder. There's a quest from the CCU. They want you to investigate a strange phenomenon in the Thunder Mine. People in Tanz and Kravia have reported seeing a strange glow night after night. The reward money is 200g. 200k. Will you accept? I'll accept. I don't know if it has anything to do with the strange glow, but some unidentified monsters have been seen in that area. So one of the nice things about... I guess not nice necessarily, but one of the cool things about uh, these missions is that you kind of... You kind of just... What am I trying to say? Uh, whoa, hold on. One of the nice things about this, uh, about these guild missions, is that you get a lot of experience as well as uh, a lot of money. Also, let me get that into the fruit of the gods. There we go. And that can become the ultimate miracle. But we don't have this, which is uh, I don't know if that's actually available for us right now. Uh, we can make this the raging roar, which we don't need. I already love the agility boost. We don't need the item grabber. And recovery up is kind of useless because anti petrify is necessary right now. Uh, this wouldn't be too bad. I don't. Dark guard's not necessarily great. Eh, I'll think about it. Oh, dark stalkers. All right. And that can be dragon lord shoes, add stun and charge heal. Another one of uh, Kazan's ultimate gears, I guess. And then you can be the dynamite bikini, but we're not going to worry about this, honestly. We, we got enough enough on our plate for the combine. Let's, uh, let's cook some heavenly beef. Which can be found if you go back to Draconia. Or Derekin Citadel, sorry, not Draconia. Uh, go back to Derekin Citadel, and instead of going into the hotel, you go to the building north of that. 
uh, you'll want to eat the uh, ultimate beef meal or whatever it is. Also, good lord, we have... <laughs> I'm saving, but... Good lord. Three levels since I saved last. That's kind of nuts. Alright, let's go to the Thundermine. But yeah, you want to go there and eat that meal. It should be the most expensive meal. It'll be like 50,000 Gs. So keep that in mind. Alright. We have a semi-tough fight coming up. And by semi-tough, I mean tough. <laughs> Like, extremely difficult. So, you can actually... Uh, honestly, we might lose. I'm kind of thankful that I healed up and saved, because this... This has the potential to be a failure. Anyway, let's go to the center, because I'm going to assume that's where we're going. Maybe not. Oh, where are we going? Uh, oh, the east. We gotta go east. My bad. I figured it would just be in the center, but clearly not. Alright, time to go over here. As far east as we can possibly go. Also, yeah, today's episode is a very long one, but you should be uh, thankful. Because <laughs> that'll give us time to do all the things in Fortune we need to do. Uh, is it up or down? Oh. What the hell? Well. I'm gonna assume... What? I'm confused. Am I supposed to do something with that? Oh! Oh, I'm dumb. I'm, I'm so dumb. <laughs> I was like, I don't understand the puzzle. What the puzzle mean? We gotta push that over. Wait. Am I dumb? Maybe I am dumb. Oh, I am dumb. Yeah, we're gonna have to reset this. Oh, we can shoot that at the very least. Yeah, I'm very dumb. Give me one second. To, to reset this puzzle, because I'm sure I just have to leave and come back. Because I understand how the puzzle works now. I'm just a little silly goober. Bit of a goofball. I messed it up. No. There we go. Okay. Puzzle is simple. You can you can destroy either just the top block or the top two blocks. Uh, hello. There we go. Killed the jelly melt. Now we're over here. I'm gonna make sure I'm fully healed. I think we'll be okay, actually. Steel. What are you doing here? You? What are you doing here? Uh, you're on a job for the guild. Do you have any idea what this is? It's a key that binds this world to another dimension. A key to another dimension? That's right. It's one of the few in existence. I don't know how it works, but it joins this world to another dimension. You've seen some strange creatures, haven't you? Some that look like they're not from this world? This key brought them here. Of course, the Black Sun has made more monsters than this key could ever bring here. Uh-oh. Well, we know exactly what this thing is. It's a wicked crystal. Looks like it's finally started. It's just a matter of time before the door to the other dimension is completely open. Don't do it! Stay out of my way. I'm warning you. Stay out of my way or I'll kill you. Steal? That's right! We gotta fight Steel, but Steel gets the ambush on us even though he's right in front of us. I don't know why he gets the ambush, but he does! Luckily he's attacking Lang. So he's gonna be doing less damage. 
All right. Well, you already know, gonna open up with a solid strike, and you are gonna give us the soaring axe, and then you are gonna gospel. Perfect. Yeah, we we really love uh, having these double attack blocks. Now, if you're wondering, Steel has 200,000 HP. So, I actually don't know how much damage we just did, but I'm going to assume it was like 70. Luckily, though, we can just, you know, use variable arts and he won't block anything. So, another thing is that Steel will block a bunch of moves. So if you try to use just a bunch of regular attacks, he will just block them. Uh, but if you use variable arts or mystic arts, he will have a very tough time, if not... Uh, I don't think it's actually even possible for him to block at that point. But we'll see. So let's do it again. And then you, I'm going to have you actually just life blessing. Just on the off chance. Blade of Fury. Ooh, Lang is stunned. That's pretty tough, actually. That means Ain's gonna do basically no damage here. And you'll actually see that Lang or Ain is uh, gonna probably have most of his moves blocked. Okay. Or yeah, see, look, he already blocked three, four hits. Not bad. Alright, I'm gonna have you do Axe Crush. And then I'll have you do Life... Uh, life Heal on Lang. Because we don't want Lang to be stunned. As much as possible. And although we could try and just go for a Mystic Art, and I could just do like a Stun Cure, I think it'll be a little better if I just do Life Heal. That's my honest opinion. Okay, let's hope that Ain hits at least two of these hits. Okay, well he did a lot more than I thought, so that's good for me. Too easy for me. 80k, that means everyone levels up. Nice, or almost everyone. Ugh, no, wait! Send me... Send me back! Steel! Huh. I should have known. It's a fake. That's right. I was a monster that was brought here from the other dimension. Now look at me. My body can't be killed in this world. Do you know how many times I've wanted to die? And can't? Can you imagine the pain of knowing that you can never go home? But I refuse to give up. The real key is out there somewhere, and I'm going to find it before the world is destroyed. Key to the other dimension. So, not only do we get that, but we also get a bunch of items. We got a vaccine syringe, which would be very helpful. Angel's Blessing, Resurrect Bottle, and a Vampire Symbol, which actually... Gives us Anti-Petrify AP Defense, which I don't know actually what that does let's let's look let's uh let's go to the banshee bangle go down to the vampire bad vampire symbol defense in proportion to rem defense up in proportion to remaining ap so if it's up with the more ap you have that would be perfect on ain uh user becomes focus of enemy attacks would be really good absorbs hp when damage is given honestly this would probably be good on ain uh, I would totally be down to get rid of the survival orb for the uh, vampire symbol. I think that would be totally worth it. Or, yeah, because I really want the AP siphon. Uh, this doesn't really matter. Well, do I need the AP siphon? Well, I have to do the, okay, yeah, let's do, let's give him the vampire symbol. Let's see what happens. Let's give him some, give him some EXP. But anyway, I will see you guys back at the guild. Money, please. 
That was it? It was those monsters that were getting off the strange glow, right? Portal in another world? I can't really believe it. I'd like to see it for it myself. I thought this quest was 200. The other 50G came from Steel. He didn't say why, he just told me to give it to you. I wonder why. Well, we got some money? Wow. All right. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. Let's do it. Number 13. Give it up for the big one. Just got word that the investigation team sent to Volcanic Isle Draconia was attacked by some huge mysterious beast. The Royal Knights that went with them are offering a prize of 240,000 G for this monster. Will you accept the quest? Accept. That's the biggest reward yet. Just what kind of monster is this thing, I wonder? Well, if it isn't Lang. Originally, the Royal Knights were supposed to do that quest. It's going to be pretty tough to do on your own. Why don't you let us help you? Oh, you have big peck muscle. You train? You eating meat, right? Yeah. Yeah, for sure. For sure. Anyway. Oh, right. Well, let's go. I was going to try and check the, the list of available quests just to make sure I'm lined up, but maybe I'm, maybe I'm being dumb. Anyway, let's go to the Draconia. This quest was going to be a little bit longer than uh, the other quests, though. There's one thing about this place, and specifically this quest... Oh, hello, Kindro. It isn't Lang. Are you here working? That's why I'm here. Charter tours. Take anywhere in the world you want to go. You can buy my services for a small sum of 100,000 G. I'll even offer a small refund if the cart breaks down. Wow, a small refund. That's awesome. Now, this... This quest is a little bit longer just because of the fact that... Oh, let's actually uh, put that on. I can always... Oh, actually, Fruit of Gods? Double up on my... Uh... <laughs> oh, did it do Heaven's Path? I want Heaven's Gate. There we go. Uh, I will be grinding off screen in this area in between episodes. I meant to do it last time, but... I just got so excited to record this video, because I've never completed all the guild missions either in this game. And it sounds like a very fun time. Alright, though, let's... I think it's this way... Oh, no, no, we gotta go this way. So, yeah, we're just going all the way back to where we fought uh, the big bads in this place. So, whenever we fought... Uh, all the monsters, or all the bosses in this area, so I'm pretty sure Elliot and Marianne have a location, or there's a location there for us to fight a monster. Uh, am I dumb? No. Okay, good. I was like, well, hold up. Am I some kind of stupid? But no, we're good. Just go deep and deeper into the cave. Oh god. This is no good. Balzac no can smash monster. What wrong? Why Balzac no smash monster? Stop talking. Just do it. We're out of money and you better get to work. Huh? Balzac get no steak tomorrow. No steak then have a hundred dream burger. Listen to me. You're not going to eat it at all if you don't get up and fight. Come on. Get up. Me not want smash. Smashing no fun. Balzac want to eat. Is that so? Well, that's just fine. I don't care anymore. I'll find a new partner. Have a nice life. No go! Fanta no leave Balzac! Balzac be good! Fanta come back! Damn, Balzac. That's fucked up. Fanta leave Balzac. We all al me all alone. Sad now. Maybe you stronger than Balzac. Balzac weak. That way Fanta leave Balzac. Uh, true. We are much stronger than you, man. Like, uh, significantly. <laughs> I mean, Ain is level 70 right now, man. We are very, very powerful. But yeah, just keep on going. Honestly, I, just on the off chance, I'm gonna... I'm gonna heal. I, I actually don't even need to. What am I doing? I literally have infinite everything. I don't... I don't even need to do anything. Like, I, I, I'm full... Boom, boom. See? I don't even I don't even need to do that. what am I doing, man? Anyway, honestly, this episode might be like an hour long. Might be even longer than that. I don't know. At the time of this where we're at in the recording right now is at a hundred or a hundred. 
an hour and 30 minutes in. So the fact... I mean, maybe I'll be able to cut out like 30 minutes. Who knows, man? Who knows? We'll see eventually. Because this might be the last guild mission for now. Uh, I don't know, though. I thought there were 14 missions, but I've I've only got 13 unlocked. Maybe you have to do the all the other missions first before you can unlock the last one. The one thing about uh, Legend of Legaia.net is that they are not in order. <laughs> Uh, the the missions that is. Okay, there we go. This is your last chance to kind of heal up and make sure you're good to go before you fight the big one. And by fight the big one, I think uh, these are actually the little guys. Oh, we're not even there yet. Damn. Boop boop boop. boop. Uh, I'm trying to just make sure I'm not being dumb. And that I am going... One, I am going the right way. And two... Yeah, okay. I'm definitely going the right way. Uh... You go further into the mountain. You find you're in trouble against a creature. Okay. So we should be getting close. At the very least, we should be very close to the mission. Why Why did I say the mission like that? Like it's a fucking... Well, it is a song title, actually. But why did I say it like that? Okay, I think it's just straight up here that, we are, that we're going. Come on, man. I forgot how long this dungeon is. Oh, here we go. Crap, I wouldn't have left Balzac if I thought things were going to get this bad. Oh. What? Balzac, why? Balzac, Balzac need Fanta. Fanta in trouble. Balzac save. Balzac need Fanta. Need more than steak. More than anything. Balzac! Yeah, time to fight this guy. Which you already know, we're opening up with a variable art. Uh, Soaring Axe, I believe, right? And then you! Ah, just use your moves. Ninety-seven hundred. Okay, yeah, that thing's dead. <laughs> Down. So soon. So that's the start of the mission. Balzac, hang in there, you big lug. Balzac. Balzac, see big steak. Me want the big steak. Juicy steak. Balzac. You called Belzec? The leader's inside there. I come. I came back to tell him that when we were attacked by that monster. You're too injured to fight. Fanta, take Balzac and get out of here. But Lang, what about you? I'm gonna get the leader. Well, I'm going to try at least. Ugh, Lang, good man. Strong man. If Belzac not hurt, me smash leader too. Alright, I'll head back to town with Balzac. Don't get yourself killed, okay, Lang? At least they were kind of nice. And not, like, rude. Also, I love how the tent just appears. I do recommend you do that if you, uh, need it. But I think we'll be okay. That's right. It's time for the leader of this shit. It's time to fight. Rugly or not, here I come. Okay, that was a bad pun. Anyway, this guy has 337,000 HP. And we're going to open up right away. Get the gospel in there. Ooh, we're getting the gospel out first. That's perfect. Uh, this thing 
is pretty hard if you're not ready. Uh, outside of the uh, for Fortune Dream fights, and outside of the final boss, this is technically the hardest or the strongest enemy in the game. Uh, outside of the final boss, once again. And also outside of the dream battles, because the dream battles are insane. <laughs> like, like, insane. Uh, is it faster than me? Hmm. Well, let's see how Zephyr does. I don't know what this move does, actually. Probably should have... Oh, eight, that's it? 800? That's nothing, bro. Oh my god. That's gonna be like 100k just there. Oh! <laughs> Mama! Holy shit! Yeah, you two just fight on over over there. I'm gonna use Nethergate, cause, and then we'll, we'll do a uh, win bullet. Oh, whoops. I meant to do Nethergate. And then, yeah, we'll do Bedrock Buster. There we go. Variable Art. God, it does so much damage. That's what one gospel does to you. Wait, did we win? No, okay. 300... 600... Yeah, this is nothing. Wow. Maybe I am way stronger than I need to be. To be fair, some of this stuff is meant to be done... Uh, prior to some of this some of these guild missions are meant to be done prior to Demir's Tower but this is not one of those missions this is one of those missions that's meant to be done after you've defeated Velna and Vestra there we go we did it that should be all the guild missions complete Let's get out of here. Return to the entrance. And go to the guild. Because the guild will show us everything. Also, really quick, uh, I did unlock the Supreme Weapon Shop and was able to buy the uh, Heaven Secret that was over there. And... The Ultimate Weapon Shop does have, or the Supreme Weapon Shop, sorry, not Ultimate Weapon Shop, uh, has some pretty good gear if you haven't been able to f build up your own stuff, uh, which I do still recommend you build up your own stuff after you buy that gear. Anyway, let's get our final request done. Just confirm the death of an unidentified monster in Draconia. Apparently that monster was called Ferocious Beast from the Fiery World, Ruglianaut. It's from some other world. You did a wonderful job. This time you get a special bonus for the danger you went through. Can't believe you defeated a monster that even the Royal Knights couldn't defeat. You must have some kind of special powers. The CCU sent you another thank you gift. They said it's a long lost treasure. Congratulations. None of the other hunters have ever killed as many monsters as you have. Acquired the nickname Iron Hunter. Is there another one? Am I dumb? Hold on. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. Why is it saying there's 13? Okay, give me one second. Let me double check that all this is right. So, I learned what the final thing is that I forgot to do. This is the final unlock requirement for the final mission. Well, final mission for me this time around, but you can do this at any time. So, what you have to do is you have to participate in at least one auction. Oh shit, what's up, Maya? What, is, what are you looking at? This place is the hangout for really rich folks, right? I feel a bit out of place. Don't worry about it, that's ridiculous. None of you feel that way. You think so? Thanks, Lang. Yeah, there's no need because we're fucking loaded, dude. Uh, how do we participate? I don't actually remember. Do I have to talk to this guy at the door? Yes, I would like to join you. Enjoy yourself and good luck. Hold up. I don't know what goodies we offer tonight, but I know I'm going to make some bids. Oh, God. Ladies and gentlemen. I'd like to extend a warm welcome to all chosen lords and ladies. So without further ado, here's our first item. 
What do you think? Inscribed sword, isn't it lovely? Begin at 8,000. Uh, wait, can I not call out? What are your plans for that one? I'll participate. How much are you thinking? We'll put, uh, we'll put 20k on it. Why not? 2200? Ah, uh, well, we'll do, uh, 24. What? You bitch! Alright, we did it. Was that worth it? Probably not. Alright. Leaf of Mrs. Oh my god, yes. We're definitely participating in this. Participate. I'm thinking we're gonna go 30k just right off the bat. Right off the rip. Nopers. Alright. This is what's nice about having a four million dollars. The wretched panelot, isn't it lovely? Uh, Eighty-two. Okay, they're kind of jumping. We'll put uh, one hundred sixty on it. Double it. It'll be a minute before we get there, but uh, we'll well let's just put one hundred twenty. That'll probably be a solid starting point. All right. Well, we'll just keep going up a little by little. Okay, son of a bitch. Relax, you motherfuckers. Fine, I'll just go to my original bet. You know what, no, we'll do 145. I think that'll be enough. Bruh! This bitch! <laughs> what the hell, it's just a painting! Fine, 160. Uh, I'm sold on 160. Bruh. There we go. 162. Alright, that's all the items. We, we, we want them all. Alright, and that should unlock the final quest for us to do. So let's go back to the guild, get that quest done, and then we'll also end the episode once we're done with the quest. Final mission. The Rake Flowers. We're accepting. Because for the first time ever, I want to complete some side stuff in this game that I've never done before. Which honestly was a part of the reason why I wanted to let's play this game for so long, because I wanted to learn more about this game than I already knew. And buddy, <laughs> I am, buddy old pal, I am happy that I've done so much research in this game. Because tireless ribbons, for example, are just game changing. And being able to have variable arts just unlock all the time is phenomenal. Okay, I believe this guy is just over here. David's standing there. There he is. You're the one sent by the guild? What I really want is the painting known as Rake Flowers. It'll be mine. Will not snatch it from me. Do you understand? Here, take this 50G. If you can bid successfully for cheaper, I should pay you handsomely. Well, I don't really care, but okay. So, all you gotta do is wait for rank flowers to be presented. Such crap does not interest me in the least. Wait and see what happens. Watch and don't bid. Alright. So yeah, this... A lot of the items will go well above the 50,000 G mark, and you kind of just want to hold off. Uh, a diamond ring. Such crap does not interest me in the least. Uh, watch and don't bid. Keep up the good work. Yeah, this stuff is pretty rough. Price is currently 63,300 G. Hey, nobody else, ladies and gentlemen. Oh. Dobsky for 64,000. Someone willing to pay over 64,700 G's. Oh my god, these motherfuckers just go back and forth. It is sold. Uh, it is lovely rake flowers. The rake flowers. I'll do anything to make it mine. I will participate in the bidding. Uh, we're going to start with 34. So I want to try and keep it 
Uh, under 50k. Let's just see. We'll do the lowest bid every time, just to see. Okay, maybe I do need to just pump it to 43. Alright, we'll just pump it to 43. Ooh, I would really like to not spend over 50. Let's go to 45. Oh my god, these bastards. These rich bastards need to stop! Bruh! Fuck it. 48,500. Oh, okay, well. Uh, hey, buddy, we're gonna have to use more than 50k. Another 25, Papa Bless. Uh, I need this, these guys to stop. Oh my god, let's just do 60. Maybe they'll shut the fuck up. This bitch! There we go. We did it. Congratulations! We hope to see you again soon. We got a resurrect bottle. Okay, let's go back to the guild and finish it off. Yeah, it's really funny that you don't even have to use your own money to get the rake flowers. Like, you just... You borrow 50k from this dude. And he just... You just get it, essentially. Alright, let's ride, let's ride the flying dragon. All the way back. To Kravia. Or Kravia, whichever. And we can finally end this nearly two hour long video I've been recording. <laughs> and yes, I've been recording for about an hour and 50 minutes as of right now, so... All right. Give me the money, baby. Switch from the battlefield to the social world of nobility. Better. I bet you like your sword better. Thanks all your hard work. You finished all the quests we have for you right now. Thank you very much. If we ever get another quest in, we'll ask you to do it, Lang. We acquired the name Guildmaster, and here's a heaven secret from the CCU for all of your distinguished service. They say there are only a few of them in the world. Looks like a rare gem. Congratulations. And that's what you get for completing all of the quests. So... Thank you all so much for watching today's episode of Let's Play the Guy 2 Duel Saga. In the next one, uh, I'm not sure. I'm thinking either exploring the rest, doing some more fortune fights just to check it out and show you guys what you might want to attempt to do, or I might just go to Demiurge Tower. We'll see. But anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.